Well, it's a milestone for the record books. It's been 30 years and a 30-year wait, but the Chattanooga Mocs are now headed to the playoffs. The Mocs football team clinched the Southern Conference regular season championship title, securing a playoff spot for the first time since 1984. News Channel Lines' Lauren St. Germain was on campus today and talked to the players and coaches behind that big win. She joins us now with the story. Lauren. Restore the glory. That's been head coach Heisman's mantra since he arrived six years ago. So could this be the year? The mocks? Well, they're on their way. Just seeing that clock hit zero and knowing we had secured that championship, I feel like that was the best moment ever. The game clock at Finley Stadium hit zero. Final score, the UTC mocks 31, Wofford Terriers 13. And just like that, the mocks are so con regular season champs. A title senior right guard, Chris Mays, says has been on the team's mind since the beginning of camp. You know, we have three goals uh, at the beginning of the season, you know, win an outright conference championship, make the playoffs, and win a national championship. So with every game, we're thinking of achieving these goals. The last time the mocks won the title SOCON champs was 30 years ago, November 10th, 1984. That's when they beat App State 21 to 20. The Mocs then lost to Arkansas State in the first round of the playoffs. Then, decades of rocky seasons. But since head coach Russ Huseman arrived in 2009, he says the goal has been to restore the glory. Now we got to do something special here, I think. And now we got to win our next two and do something special in the playoffs. Something special that the students and community are hoping for. The city of Chattanooga has really rallied behind us. We are so excited for UTC and hoping that they really kill it in the playoffs because I know we can go all the way. As a fan and a, a person who supports the football team, it was very exciting you know, knowing that it's been a while since they won the, the conference outright. We're in, uh, so we're one of 24 teams that's going to have a chance in the national championship. And they have two more games against Tennessee Tech and conference rival Furman. The Mocs won't know exactly where they stand until Sunday, November 23rd. The first round of FCS playoffs begin the 29th. But if they are ranked in the top eight, which coach says there's a chance, they will have a bye week and host a playoff game the week after. Today, the Mocs also moved up in the FCS coaches poll to number nine, tying a program record. How about that? Top ten. Pretty cool. Lots yeah. going on there. Definitely. Thanks a lot, Lauren.